So, you have a few options. I can swab you, you can swab yourself, whirl it around and put it into this, or you can pee into a cup. Okay, I'll do the swab, followed by a blood test for HIV, syphilis, and hepatitis, okay? So, uh, any plans for the weekend? It's my stomach. It's been so upset lately. First, I thought it was food poisoning, but I wasn't, you know. Then I thought maybe, maybe it was motion sickness, but I haven't gone anywhere, so that didn't make sense. Now I'm pretty much used to it. I've been nauseous every morning for a month. Kathy, do you think you might be pregnant? <laughs> Hell no. I haven't slept with a guy in a decade. I'm a lesbian. You can't get pregnant. If you date women, you can't get pregnant. I don't date women, problem solved. No, I mean if I date women. I'm still on that. It didn't even occur to me that if I sleep with women, I never have to worry about the condom breaking or being surprised by just the tip or the off chance that my IUD might malfunction. Am I being yelled at? No, this is amazing. I can have wild, passionate sex with a woman and never worry about getting pregnant again. But do you want to put your face in their bikini biscuit? Alex. Alexander. Bikini biscuit? Lady dates expect you to put your face in their fur burger, their bearded oyster, their bloody hatchet wound, their- Jen. Jen? Jen, she's from Australia. You're going on a date with the thunder from down under? She's cute. At least you'll never have to worry about a dingo eating your baby. Hey, Molly. <clears throat> I'm telling you, the lady land down under, it's kind of gross. How would you know? Because I've been there. <clears throat> you've been to Australia? Twice. Are you telling me that you've had sex with a woman? What? I went to summer camp. Summer camp? I've been there. Isn't that what we're calling going down on a girl? You've gone down on a girl? I'll be. I want to go to summer camp. Alexander, I'm not sure I'm ready to go to summer camp. Summer camp? I used to go all the time as a kid. Loved swimming, but hated wearing my bathers. Uh, Were you waiting long? I'm Jen. Paula. Do you want to grab a cuppa? Yeah, definitely. Still if can do anything, but it will never fix me. I still need a doctor and a lot of therapy. No, you are not my lithium, you are not my Prozac. But when you come over, you are my July summer sunshine on my back. And that calm voice soothes me like an ice pack. Don't laugh, no, I really mean that you change me. And you motivate me in spite of all the pills and the side effects. In spite of the panic attacks, you don't need Yes, please. You should really visit Australia, though. It's very hot this time of year, although Tassie is wet. It's always wet. We used to go there as kids to visit my grandpa. Do I tell her I've never been on a date with a girl before? Can she tell I've never gone down under before? In high school, I made out with more girls than guys. Should I wait for her to kiss me? Or should I kiss her first? But do I want to go down on her? Does she want to go down on me? Maybe I'm too femme for her. Or not femme enough. How does that work? If I don't want to go down on her, does that mean I don't want to go down on all women or just this woman? My dad was just all, I love you no matter who you're into. Jesus, he's cute. Yeah, he was really cute. He was just so open-minded and loving. I really miss him, you know? Bad jokes and all. Yeah.
Wow. I think I'm straight. Oh. You're never gonna cure me or not my new religion But in you I found something good to believe in Oh, you are not my white knight, you are not my life Me again, Paula Burrows. I play Paula. Please help us to spread the word about the dangers of online dating by liking, subscribing, and sharing. You can find us at D-O-O-D the series. Oh look, time for another episode.